So let's take a look at how Power BI Sentinel can get you out of trouble. What happens when someone deletes a business critical Power BI report? What makes a change that breaks something? How do you know what's changed, who did it, and more importantly, how do you recover quickly? Well, if we take a look at the Power BI Sentinel portal, we can see here a list of all our workspaces. We can choose a workspace, and in here we can see all the reports in it. We can choose a report, and then we can see a backup history for that particular, uh, particular data set. Sentinel backs up your report every night to your own Azure Blob Storage, and you can come in here, choose any file you want, and download it. And that then downloads to your local PC, where you can then look at that PBIX file in Power BI Desktop and do with it whatever you want. Now, you may, may want to use that to roll back. All you have to do in desktop is just click Publish, and it'll roll back that report. You may just want to look at it to see what, what's changed. Um, or if someone's deleted a report, you can go back and download the most recent version of it and then recover it that way. Uh, internally, Power BI has no undelete, no rollback facility, so this is the only way of really achieving that. So let's say something's changed in a report and you want to roll it back. Well, you also want to know what was changed. You want some history of that. And Sentinel automatically performs change tracking on these reports. So we can choose any two versions of a report, run a comparison against it, and it'll show you what changed between these reports. So here we've got some visual changes, uh, height and width has changed, uh, a, a, a visual type has changed here from cluster column chart to gauge. We've got a filter change on this visual, a change to a power query, change to a, to a measure. And we get all the details in here as well, such as the uh, what it was before and what it is now. So you can clearly see where there's a difference between the old and the new. You can also use this to see if you do roll back this report, what's the impact going to be? Are there other changes that have been made that you don't want to roll back? And you can use this to really get a feel for how best to roll back and get that report up and running again. So the next question is, well, who made that change? And this is where the audit logs come in. Sentinel keeps a full history of audit logs in your own Azure SQL database that you can then query and report on as you wish. So all of these different operations here in, in Power BI get tracked. Here we've selected who's created data flows. But if we look at who's deleted a data set, we can see that this user from that IP address has deleted those uh, data sets from these workspaces on that date and time. So you can very clearly see exactly who's done what. And we've even got things like edit data sets, so you can see who's made a change to a particular data set. Uh, and this expand, extends to who's uh, exported reports, etc. So with this, you can tell who's made a change or deleted something, when they did it, what they did, and with the backup facility, you can then automatically roll back and recover very, very quickly. Using these, you can minimize your recovery time objective down to minutes rather than days. Mm -hmm.